I see you have returned, dear Saiyan. Thanks to you, my power will only grow to greater heights. doesn't understand the full beauty of this time ring. Where it protects me. Not even what a god did in the past can affect me. I can't believe he actually killed a Supreme Kai. But of course, as you know, only a Supreme Kai can wield the power of the time rings. To bring about the justice I desire, I needed the perfect sympathizer as my ally. A fighter I could trust, who agonized as I did over the folly of mortal kind. Someone I knew for certain longed for the same grand utopia in their heart. In other words, he needed me. In this reality you see as an alternate future, I was floundering in despair. I lacked the will to act. I knew from the box of rings this parallel future existed, so I came to forge my alliance. Thank you, Goku. Your anger feels simply incredible. <laughs> Foolish! <laughs> That means beat. Mercy shall not you must pay for your sins against time. Now die! Maybe I am a sinner, but I don't care. I'll do whatever it takes to save this planet. Paladins, I didn't think you were capable of reaching this level of power. Does make for perfect. Here I come. Taste my blade. Crap. Magnificent. The body of a Saiyan is the ultimate and divine blessing. Scatter to the wind! Say it! Turn anger into power! Huh! My limitless wrath makes me the strongest being in the universe. I'll hold them off and give them everything I've got. But in case I fail, you need to find a way to defeat them. Goku and the others are back, as expected. So, the curtain rises, and our Act 3 begins. Ah.
Our master Goesu and the other Kais were foolish enough to believe mortals could be entrusted with intellect. As a result, you malefactors have developed time travel. A privilege only meant for the Kais. This machine is the quintessential reason why your kind must be eliminated. Well, it appears they're not listening to you. No matter. I'm so intoxicated by myself, I don't care if I have an audience. One of the many benefits of being a god. Fine. What's done is done. I'd rather win with our fist than some magic trick anyway. <laughs> I was just thinking the same thing. are a gift from the gods, as is their energy. But you arrogant saint act as if you created this strength all on your own, you fool! <laughs> now i figured it out. The reason for the runaway growth is your power level compared to my own. It's anger, isn't it? Watching us hurt your son made you angry. So that's how Saiyan strength works. How primal. Turning your raw emotions into power. Only a pathetic mortal like yourself could thrive on a tactic that unrefined. Which explains why it took me so long to realize it. Then I too shall use my anger. Anger toward the mortals who defile the universe. Anger toward the other gods who have tolerated such behavior. And most importantly, the white, hot rage I now feel toward myself for letting you get the upper hand on me in our battle! You won't surpass me! This was just the start! I'm channeling my divine rage into power! I have forged a new instrument with which to destroy you! This side will call a reminder into your mortal flesh of the strength of my divine feet. <laughs> Insufficient. <laughs> the matter, mortals? Relax! Don't be afraid. I thought you Saiyans loved fighting the strongest. My counterpart's energy just vanished. Then just as suddenly it reappeared. But now it feels much weaker for some reason. Like he's barely present. He must have run into some trouble completing his part of our gambit. yourself against those mortals. We were barely separated. What went wrong? It seems many of our assumptions about mortals were badly mistaken. They are much more than just insignificant worms. If we're not careful, our dream of utopia is going to be ruined before it's even begun. Very well. No more games or half-measures. We 
Because these insolent mortals continue to defy and profane us, we will reveal to them the ultimate power of the gods. It's time to show them divine perfection made whole. You pathetic, lowly mortals. Kneel before our radiance! And bow down before our splendor. Worship me. Give praise unto me. Me, the beautiful, the sublime. Me, the invincible, the almighty and divine. All hail, Samus. I can feel it. Two glorious and unparalleled powers dissolving into one within me. So he's even stronger now. That's just what we need. The power coursing through me is exceptional. Glorious. Absolute. Stare in awe. I am justice incarnate. Trumps, keep Bulma safe! You insolent, minuscule saints. Bear witness as I show you the power of my divine light. Hearken unto me. I am the brightly glowing sun in the sky which illuminates this world. And all shall know that my brilliance is justice. I, the god Zamasu, am the universal wisdom, the universal law, and yes, the universal power. And all those who my light shines upon shall be oblivious. At long last, on this glorious day, Project Zero Mortals will culminate with the eradication of all life on this planet. Then, Toga will rise from the ashes. What the hell is he talking about? Don't get ahead of yourself, Zamasu. First, you have to beat me. Lo, still denying the inevitable. Perhaps a further demonstration of my power will help you face the truth. Tone for your indiscretion with your life! So are we. Now, to rend the land, cleansing of all that is impure. So begins the Jubilee, heralding the arrival of a divine new world! This is the definition of justice. Power, wisdom, flame, light, return with vengeance to consecrate anew this divine world. Now the unclean world, stained with the violent plague of mortal kind, is remade. Born of divinity by heaven's sake. Like I said before, you're going to have to go through me first! You creeps refuse to acknowledge your limits. Well, perhaps it will only sink in once my power tears you both to pieces. Oh, shut up! You should know by now, Saiyans don't do limits! Gods are meant to look down on mortals. You are not worth it. Now witness the wrath of the gods! Go kill! Thomasu! Get ready, cause I'm knocking your lights out for good! You simple-minded, barbarous Saiyan. It is the light of the mortals that will soon be extinguished. And... 
great honor to fall at the hands of a god, is it not? The beginnings of a new era abide on this planet. Lightning of absolute It's over. Blasphemous fool! You continue to defy a god! Light of divine justice! Strike at me now! A cowering god who appeases evil can never prevail! Who are you? Get ready for this! You two doubled up, so we did the same. You know, just to play fair. We're a merged fighter, a combination of Vegeta and Kakarot. Vegito! And here's something new. Vegito Blue! Yeah! You may be more powerful, but you're still not a god! You, pathetic mortals, always try to emulate the divine. Now why is that? Is it because we gods are so wondrous? Are you coveting our undeniable beauty? It's so tragic. You are doomed to fail. Acts of gods are beautiful because we are inherently pure while mortal endeavors will inevitably become wicked. Corrupted and marred by sin! Sorry, but if you want me bowed at your feet, you'll have to do it by force! I don't need your prostrations, mortal. I just need you dead! Something that's always going to be a part of you for as long as you live. Ghost, mortal, and destructible body. That Goku's body will always be part of me. Of course he will. Such was my desire. If you get a divine power, you're stuck. Most dear Saiyans are the ultimate symbol of the failure of the Kai. By taking Goku's flesh into my being, I have assumed both the sins of mortal kind and the failure of divinity, so they may never be repeated. Got an answer for everything, huh? You see. I do this for the good of the cosmos. For creation! Are you seriously crying? I am. And proudly so. My tears shall sanctify this blighted world. Mortals, you must be expunged. A pure and perfect multiverse made clean by Zabasu's hand! 
each other to survive that's what redeems us that's what makes us who we are makes us worthy that's what gives us our real power Existence. Go away! 